Hi, my Not Your Beauties. It's your girl, Roy Therese, coming today. You guys, I'm coming today with my top five um, Valentine's gift for your mister or for your little monsters. I call my mister, my husband, the mister. So that's what I'm referring to. And the little monsters, of course, is my kids. That's what I call them. So I'm coming today with my top five under 50, under 50 bucks um gifts ideas for your family so starting with the who are we gonna start with first y'all let's start with the mister number one everybody know a watch you can find a cute watch um at the mall for less than 50 bucks at Walmart. If you know your husband is not like a materialistic person, you can find one at the mall. Or if he just need a work watch, you can find it at Walmart. You know, those little um, black watches with the band that's like unbreakable if your husband do like outdoorsy work or hand work, hardcore work. Then yeah, Walmart, you know, um, the mall and... Um, who else you could find in it? Target. And um, you guys, while I'm talking about this stuff, of course, I'm going to have pictures. And I'm, I'm going to look up these places that I'm telling y'all to show y'all where you can literally the prices of a decent watch. And then um, that's my number one thing. And, um, of course, cologne. You bought myself good cologne, you guys. I was shocked. They sell that good stuff. Literally, they sell that good stuff. And you can find some good cologne at um, Target or in the little, um, it's, I think every mall have them because every mall I've been to, wherever we've been stationed at, always have one. Like that one particular store that sells nothing but cologne and perfume, you can find some good reasonable price um, cologne up in there. And then you can find some at Target, you know, Whatever, even if it's just the body spray they have now, the axe and all that, that's at Walmart, and that stuff smells so good. Walmart, CVS, um, Walgreens, all that, because I coupon that type stuff. So, and that stuff smells good. And even um, Bath and Body Works have um, good me. I didn't even know, girl. Why y'all ain't tell me? Bath and Body Works sell men's stuff now. Like, girl, and they have it on sale all the time. It, less than 50 bucks. So you can get the body spray, you can get the shower gel, and you can get the um what all I got him? It was three different things. It was the body spray, the shower gel, and the shave cream. And it all smells this girl. Ooh. And you can catch it on sale. You can catch it on sale. So that's number two. And then number um, three would be like a reasonable outfit. If you know your man, you know, it's time to re-up on his clothes. Despite the fact, y'all, Christmas was just a couple months ago. So they don't really need it. But we'll get it because we love them, right? I know. So um, you can go to Ross. You can go to Marshalls. You can go to um, TJ Maxx. You don't have to necessarily go to the mall to get this Burlet girl Burlington. I love Burlington's for my husband. I ooh, you can find some good stuff in Burlington. Don't sleep on Burlington. You can find a whole outfit for fifty bucks. Seriously, you really can. And then um, number where we on? That's two, three. I think we on number four for the men. Then number four would be like little trinket stuff. If your husband into like um. Maybe he into the little pocket knives or the little um, pocket watch, uh, not watches, the lights and stuff that you can use. Y'all know, because I bought the Mr. Little Pocket Knife for um, Christmas that I got from, I think it was Burlington's or Ross. And it was like 12, 13 bucks and it had like all kinds of little gadgets connect to it. It had the screwdriver, the knife a light it was all kinds of little gadgets connected to it if i could find a picture of that um i will um post it on here or i'll just look when he get home from work i just ask him for him to take a picture of it <laughs> right smart but um yeah those kind of things and also you know if 
He need if you forgot to get the socks and the underwear and stuff like that during Christmas, it's a good time for that. Men need that type of stuff. And they ain't gonna tell you they need it, girl. You just gotta go get it and be like, oh yeah, I needed some of that stuff. And deodorant and um shower gel, shave cream. You know, you can make a little cute basket dollar tree, you guys. Last Christmas, was it last Christmas? Not last Christmas. What was that? Let me think, y'all. Father's Day. Father's Day. I made him a cute, cute, cute basket from Dollar Tree, you guys, using all Dollar Tree products. And it was like um, mechanical stuff that Dollar Tree had going on for Father's Day. If I could find a picture of that, I will post that, too. So you can go to Dollar Tree and make a little cute little basket, fill it up with deodorant, body wash, shave gel, some socks, underwear, you know, whatever you think he might need to look cutesy, pocket watch thingy. If he likes lighters, if he smoke, smoking is bad for you, but if he smoke, then, you know, a lighter, just in case he be the lost the one he had. You know, stuff like that, y'all, less than 50 bucks. Less than 50 bucks. I'm telling you, y'all can get this stuff, and they'll be the thinking you spent the arm and leg, and you ain't spend no more than $50, literally, or sometimes even less. Now, my favorite, favorite, favorite is the number one thing for me, is something very meaningful. Think outside the box, literally outside the box. And you know who helps me with thinking outside the box, you guys? Because I know um, a lot of people be like, well, I don't know what to do. What you going to do? What you going to do? I don't know what you going to Listen, Pinterest is my best friend. Pinterest. Go on Pinterest. Google, like, meaningful ideas, um, reasonable ideas, affordable ideas. And all that type of stuff come up. If you want to do a little cute DIY, you don't have no money right now, you like your coins ain't right. Do a cute little Dollar Tree DIY and there you go, girl. You in there. I'm telling you. Last year for my husband, y'all know I go out a lot for this man because he's spoiled, but it's okay. We un I've come to the to accept the fact that the man is fault. It's not, it's my fault. I was about to say it was, but you you said it's my fault before I even could get it out. But it's okay. Oh, it's okay. Y'all, I can't help it. He deserve it. Don't judge me. He deserve it. I'd give him the world if I had it. He deserve it. But back to this man. I did the five senses last um, Valentine's Day for him. So he had the touch. He had a, Touch, smell, see, taste, and it was uh, it was five. I can't think of the fifth one. And so he had five gifts for all uh, five senses, and it was just like I did for Christmas, like the twelve days of Christmas, something reasonable, didn't go all out the way. And I just made the little girl Pinterest hook me up. I made the little um picture frame the little pictures went to dollar tree got the little bags and the balloons he got a picture y'all i did it i did girl i did that i didn't even spend a lot of money and i printed the stuff if you don't have a printer at home go to the library library would charge you 10 15 cent to print it ain't much to print sis so don't worry about be like girl i ain't got no printer i ain't got no printer that's what you saying girl i ain't got no printer i ain't got i know you don't have one. It's okay. It's okay. Listen, I'm serious. If you have a library near you, go to the library. 15 cents. 10 to 15 cents per page. And you don't need no, no but five pages. Maybe six. Because I think it was like a picture frame thing. And then you put all five cents in another one. So, you ain't spending nothing, sis. Go get that stuff printed. Or call, the, call your home girl. Your sister, daddy, uncle, cousin, crazy. Yeah, them. Call them. Have them to print your stuff out. And go to the Dollar Tree and hook it up. Go to Walmart. Get your stuff. Or Target. TJ Maxx for Marshalls. Get all your little goodies. Because for taste, you ain't got to get nothing but like maybe some candy. That's it. For smell, that little Walmart cologne I was talking about. Or either even, uh, um, what is it? Body, um, 
body wash, child. I can't even think. Body wash. You can use that. It just think outside the box. Go on Pinterest. I'm telling you, I love that. Pinterest always helped me thinking outside the box. Pinterest the one who gave me the idea of the 12 days of Christmas for the mister. I was going to do it for the misters and the monsters, but one year they made me mad, so I cut them short. Y'all know how we do. You, they make you mad, you be like, uh, snatch everything from it. So that's what I did. So they, they don't get 12 days of Christmas, despite the fact they get a lot of junk. You know, they still got, they still get their stuff, but... Anywho, so that's for the mister. See how simple that is? That's something simple. You ain't spending five arms and ten legs. No more than $50, you guys. And if you don't even got that, you can spend $25. It depends on what your coins say, babe. What your, what your pocketbook say, baby? That's what you get, honey, because you ain't even got to spend that much. I'm telling you, Walmart got those little colognes, that body wash. The deodorant, the shave gel, all that. And you go to Dollar Tree, get the little stuff to um, put with the basket. And there you go for literally a little and a nothing. Seriously, affordable, affordable, affordable. That's what we think when it comes to gifts. Because I'm telling you, these holidays pop behind each other. And we like, wait, my pocket can't handle all this because I just did that. Like, seriously, I just did that. Now I have to go buy more gifts. No, you don't, sis. No, you don't. That's why I love that meaningful thing. Because you don't really have to buy too much of nothing. And you get to make everything. You can DIY it as how you want it. Heck, your, your touch and taste and smell could be something not the kitchen. Seriously. It could be some... Oh, y'all. It could be some... Uh, what is that stuff called? Whipped cream, girl! Adults only. That whipped cream. <laughs> adults only. Kids, adults only. But whipped cream with some chocolate or some chocolate-covered strawberries, you could do those yourself. The strawberries ain't but $2, y'all. Kroger's, two for $4. <laughs> but enough about the mister, because I can go on with gifts about for the mister. Seriously, I can go on forever. But with the kids, the top five gifts with me, with my kids, I normally, honestly, you guys... um. They'll get something like some candy apples. I'll get them made for them. Um, they ain't no more than five or six dollars. Or go to like the it's if you guys have like a candy store in your area, go get some chocolates or something like that that they be done made and give them that. Go get the little five ten dollar um teddy bear at Walmart. Go the day of Valentine's Day to Walmart for the little monsters. I'm telling y'all, that's how you do it. I do it every year. The day of Valentine's Day, I go to Walmart and I rack up for my kids. It's half price. Half price. I'm not trying to get that stuff early. Half price, baby. We shop on the sale with a budget on the bargain. All of the above. <laughs> no, but for real. So half price, go to those stores the day of. I know you don't want to fight that crowd, but you got to get up early or you go like, so when you get up, we'll roll in there and get that stuff and get on out the door. But I usually go early in the morning, grab up everything I need. It's half off. Seriously. You can go get the body spray instead of going to Bath and Body Works, spend the arm and leg, which they still have a sale. So that's still good. You can get that from Walmart. Or you can get them a cute little watch, Walmart. And then the day of, literally the day of, like I just said, the day of, you can get the teddy bear. You can get the candy. You can get, is that my little monsters? You can get all that the day of. Half off. Walmart. Target. TJ Maxx. Marshalls. Burlington's, everybody, half off. If your kids love like the little t-shirts that have the I love you stuff on, if they corny like me, then Burlington's, five, six dollars, that is. Even um, the teddy bears, I love teddy bears. Y'all know I'm a teddy bear freak. Don't judge me, don't judge me. I don't have a lot of them, and I know y'all looking like, if she get a teddy bear every holiday, every 
year, then how many bags she have? I don't have that many because I get rid of them after a certain amount of time. I declutter. Some of them have to go. Because, like, right now I have, I think it's about six. Six from the last three years. So, two for one for Valentine's Day and one for Christmas. So, yeah, for the last three years. So, I got six. So, I, I don't have that many, you guys. I get rid of them. So, don't be thinking I'm a hoarder around here collecting bears. She don't do that. She don't do that. But, that's my top. Um, did I go through five for the kids? Yeah, I got all excited. So, we said Walmart for the body spray, right? Then we said Target got some too, and they'd be reasonable price. Then we said candy. Um, that's another thing. Walmart, Target. And then the teddy bear, Walmart, Target. Remember, go the day of because it'd be 50% off. Then you can um, get the little t-shirts that have Valentine, Happy Valentine's Day. You know how Walmart, Target sell those. Half off the day of. Yep. Mm-hmm. She do it every year. <laughs> Don't judge me. Y'all know me. Don't judge me. But, yeah, and then uh, the fifth thing for the Little Monsters would be, like, a little watch or something. Or if you want to get them, like, um, say, for instance, you want to get them a little necklace like this. Um, this ain't cost no $50, y'all, though. But um, Walmart and I, I don't know if Target sell jewelry. Yes, they sell jewelry. So you probably could find one of these. It's probably not going to last that long. Oh, y'all, the little booths in the mall that sells the, like, the cubic zirconia stuff. You can find something for about 50 bucks for the little monsters if you want to get them, like, a little heart necklace, a little heart ring. For $50, they'll have something. It ain't going to last long, y'all. Ask me how I know. They don't last long, but you get the insurance on it. Get the insurance on it. Ain't no more than $3, $4, but you can get the insurance on it. And, um... Less than 50 bucks, they could get a little necklace like, you know, not like this, not, but like this. Y'all know what I mean with the little heart and stuff like that and the ring with the, on it and stuff like that. Yeah, because this one no $50. Mm. We ain't going to tell you how much it costs. That's why I spoiled him. He spoiled me. <laughs> don't judge me. Don't, don't. Mm. Mm. But... <laughs> You guys, so that's the top five things I would like to do for the Little Monsters as well. So now that you guys know what I... Oh, and if you ain't got no coins to do none of the above, y'all. Y'all know I'm extra. And you know a girl love to cook. And you know she love to be fancy and set it up all cute and all of the above. And if you want to do a fancy little breakfast and or a fancy little dinner... Instead of going out and buying all these gifts, and you just want to get them a car. You know men don't mind. They love food. You know kids love food. So they ain't worried about no gift. You can go to Dollar Tree, get them a card, get a couple balloons, go get some dinner. It's your choice, whatever you want. It could be pasta. It could be um, seafood. It could be steak. Whatever your $50 coins can stretch to. Make it out cute. Set it up. With your little Dollar Tree stuff, the, what is that stuff called? Come Dollar Tree heart confetti stuff all over the place and the little dollar balloons and the, girl, I'll post the pictures. Y'all yeah, know I'm extra. Don't, I hear you judging me in the background. Y'all yeah, know I'm extra. And I love to do it for my family every year. Don't, don't judge, don't judge me. They spoil. They all are. My fault. My fault. Huh? She? Me? I guess. <laughs> y'all. Yeah, so y'all know I love cooking them a huge shebang dinner, breakfast, lunch, whatever for Valentine's Day. And since I won't be here for Valentine's Day this year, that video will be coming out explaining what's going on with me, where I'm about to go. But since I won't be here, we already pre-celebrated 
Valentine's Day. So I will post the pictures of, um, I'm not gonna post pictures of this year's Valentine's Day because I want to do the video on Valentine's Day. So y'all won't see that. Okay. You won't see that, but you will see Valentine's Day pictures from, um, last year and from 2017. I'll post those and then be on the lookout for Valentine's Day this year. It will actually be posted on Valentine's Day. You know, it won't be here. <laughs> so, you guys, I'm trying to get this mukbang together because everybody was requesting. I asked if they want me to do a uh, sit down um, hair, makeup, or mukbang. Of course, they went with mukbang. Video explaining what's going on with the taps, where we going next, where is she about to head, because y'all know she's... Oh, God, I'm about to be going at the door, y'all. So, uh, hopefully, I can get that mukbang done um, in the next couple of days because I'm about to be going in the next couple of days. So, let's hope I can get it done during lunch, which is going to be hard because I eat lunch every day with my mister. So, we got to see how I'm going to record that. But if I don't get it done, I'm just going to have to do a sit down with me, you guys. And y'all have to forgive me about it and just sit down um, and talk like I'm doing now. And y'all going to have to cuss me out later, okay? I'll just have to owe y'all a mukbang when I get back. How about that? <laughs> but anywho, I've been talking to you guys for too long. And I know y'all be like, girl, this is too long for this video for you to say five different things. Girl, y'all know I like to talk. Don't judge me. You know I like to talk. But if this is your first time watching this video, don't forget to thumbs it up. Also, we would love for you to hit that subscribe button. And for those of who's always supporting me, always ride it down me. I got a couple of y'all. I love y'all to death. Thanks, 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 thanks so much. Especially to the little monsters because they are faithful watchers, you guys. Love those kids. Even though they drive their mama crazy. Mm. Love them. But, um... Thanks for all the support, you guys. I'm about to be gone. So, literally, thanks for the support. Thanks for riding with your girl. I've only been doing this for seven months. And I really, honestly, have been enjoying it. So, I'm going to have some pre-recorded videos for you guys. I'll explain all that to y'all later in that mukbang video if I can get that out. But, I think I should be able to get it out. <laughs> Explain to y'all about these pre-recorded videos and about me getting ready to leave. Anywho, once again, thanks for watching. Bye.